Guys, Alien Worlds is back. I'm back to talk about Alien Worlds. I thought this game was on live support. I thought this game was uh, maybe done, but it's not. It's better than ever. Let's check this out. So guys, before you go any farther, if you don't know what Alien Worlds is, check out my first video. I'll link it up here. Talks all about the stuff. Now, a lot of it's outdated, but at least you'll get an idea of what the game is and how to do it. Uh, there's some stuff you don't have to worry about anymore, such as setting your bag. It all works now in the UI, so that's good. Also, I could always use a like, a subscription, hit that bell so you, you find out when I got more videos coming. Appreciate it. Okay, guys, so before we get into all the good stuff that I'm excited about, let's at least talk about the uh, not-so-great news. Um, NFTs are still not a thing right now. Uh, used to be when you played Alien Worlds, you, you're, you're hunting for NFTs along with the trillion that, that they pay you for mining you mine. You get paid TLM, and then hopefully you'll find an NFT, and it could be a really awesome NFT. Well, that's, that is still on hold for now, okay? And so that's kind of a bummer. But it's coming back soon. They said after missions and missions is out. We're going to talk about that in a minute. Let's take a look at this new UI. So if you go to play.alienworlds.io, we'll sign in. So guys, the thing that really brought me back is an email. I'm on their newsletter. You got to get on their newsletter. I'll show you. I'll put a link in how to get on their newsletter. Uh, a couple weeks ago that uh, mobile, their mobile app was finally working. As those of you who have played this game um, know, it's never worked on mobile devices, right? It just kind of freezes. Well, now they said it works. So I went out, I pulled up my Brave Mobile, and sure enough, it worked. And the UI really got me charged up. Um, it's since kind of broken on Brave. So if you're going to play it in the mobile app, or if you're going to play the mobile app on your phone, use Chrome, probably Safari if you want to use that. Ugh. But yeah, let's take a look. So look, we got our inventory right up front. It's got all of our inventory. So it's got our uh, equipment. This is my avatar. I got one avatar. I don't know. It should be shown. I don't know. Weapons. No land. I wish I had land. And minions. Kind of nice. I like it. It's got, they've got all the information on it. You can, you can roll over it, get some more information. It also tells you when it's time to mine. You get a little, little dingy ding. Let's just mine, why don't we? Now I'm going to probably get like point zero something. It's not like it in the old days where you could get two, seven. You might be able to, to still get that stuff with the right equipment. Uh, right now I'm just doing three uh, drills and I'll show you that in a minute. <clears throat> All right, point zero six. Not so great, but whatever. There's my timer. Awesome. Here's our mine information. Holy moly, that guy has cranked up his percentage. I'm coming. I'm getting out of there. Sheesh. Switch tools. You can see this is my inventory. Before, you, you couldn't do this um, here. If you wanted to do three at a time, you had to do it uh, somewhere else. But now, you, now it's very easy. I just click change. I can pick one of my other tools if I want to. Here's some nice stats over here about what I've got going. My luck, my proof of work, how long it takes to get, my, to get the TLM once I click mine. All right, this person's cranked up the percentage, so I don't want to do that. Let's go. Let's try something else. There's five. Per oh, good. And here's another great thing. Percentage is right up top so you know what kind of a cut they're trying to get. Just to review, this is the mining power for the land, how much TLM you might get, uh, the higher the better. And this is the NFT percentage. This is how long it takes uh, add to the calculation to actually do the mining. Uh, but this one is kind of irrelevant right now because they shut that off. But here we got, we got active volcano, two and a half. I'm currently on an active volcano, I believe. Um, and I'm paying 25%, so I'm gonna leave that place. You very nice to just set that right in here, and now I'm on a different piece of land, that's awesome. I could change planets if I'd like. There's our planets. Oh, and now's as good a time as any to show you the uh, newsletter that they send out, because I'm gonna go check out this mining event and see if I need to be someplace else. Lots of good information, uh, very cool. So when I say they don't, they don't give out NFTs, you're not, they're not giving it out within the game. But there's always contests going on for mining different lands. You could win NFTs, that sort of thing. They're giving NFTs away for, for mining lands. They're doing it manually. It's just not within the game. So um, there you go. You're going to want to be mining this weekend on the Alien Worlds. There, there are NFTs dropping like trick-or-treats. That's what the great peacemaker number one said. And guys, you're going to want to go to Alien Worlds uh, official Discord. They're, that's where they're doing a lot of giveaways, a lot of uh, information, missions. We're going to get to missions in a minute. And I just found out that they're having uh, some, some sort of uh, Halloween uh, Twitch thing going on here in just a few minutes. So we'll get to see what that is.
Apparently there's zombies in the metaverse. Gotta watch out that name. Facebook's gonna take it soon. So while I wait to find out where the zombies are at and where I need to uh, mine to get some special rewards, let's continue. So on this page, you got your inventory. You can do your shining. I explain that in detail in the first video. So here, staking for governance, uh, teleport. So guys, let's skip over teleport, go to missions, and I'll come back to teleport because teleport's important due to missions. So missions are out. They are amazing. It's out. You're gonna connect to your BSC. BSC being Binance Smart Chain. You've gotta connect to Binance Smart Chain to uh, do missions, and you're gonna wanna do missions. It's really, really cool. To connect to the Binance Smart Chain, you can see up here, you've gotta have uh, MetaMask. So go download MetaMask, and you'll see that I've got a network called Smart Chain. That didn't happen automatically. Uh, you click here, you're gonna to go to settings. Go to settings, scroll down to networks. Uh, you're gonna add a network. I've added Smart Chain. All right, Smart Chain. RPC is uh, right here. Chain ID is 56, symbols BNB. And the block explorer is blah and i'll stick all these down in the description so you can quickly uh copy and paste them and then you've got the smart chain and then you can connect your uh any world's account to the smart chain and then you're ready to do some missions so guys here's the missions page it's very very awesome basically these missions are done they're completed these missions are in progress and they'll come back soon. This one's gone for four weeks, one week, two weeks. Basically, you're just locking up some TLM and you're gonna get rewarded for it. It's, it's pretty fun. It's, it's a cool way for them to tell you that you stake TLM to them on the Binance Smart Chain. And in return, you're gonna get a little bit of all these rewards. So let's say we did the uh, supply request. Your TLM would have to be locked away on your Binance Smart Chain uh, wallet for a week. When that time is up, you'll get a piece of this, these, these rewards here based upon how many spacecrafts have left, and you'll get an NFT. That's right, you'll get a missions NFT, which are brand new NFTs, can't get anywhere else but doing the missions. When do new missions come out? I don't know. I just barely missed this last one, which was a four week mission, and I had to lock away a thousand TLM. Currently, what I believe is these come out randomly. You gotta be watching for them, and you'll have a little bit of time before they depart uh, to get your TLM locked away in your in your wallet and to buy ships you can buy multiple ships uh the 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 uh the lower the rarity the cheaper it costs to buy a ship to go on that mission um i believe the lowest spaceship is 40 tlm so this is pasha the spammer very very helpful on the alien worlds discord uh they told me i want to say she i don't know why i want to say she pasha I'm gonna just say that they told me the base price is 40 TLM for a ship for a common missions and every next rarity rank increases by a previous by five times. So the one that just took off, the mission that just took off a few minutes ago, this bad boy, Gal Galaxy Exploration for four weeks, this cost 1000 per ship TLM to lock away. Again, you're not spending that, you're just staking it, you get it back. So if commons are 40 and it goes up by five every time, let's do the math. These are 40 per ship. This, these would be times five, 200 per ship. So 200 times five would be a thousand per ship. So these are, this right here is, uh, I'm assuming is a, uh, gonna be 5,000 per ship. The first column of the board shows the mission types. There are eight kinds. Exploration, battle, scouting, artifact, courier, supply, liberation, and recovery. So those are the eight types. You have this is how long you're gonna be gone. So this legendary, I assume is what it is, they're gone for three months. Uh, but when they get back, let's see what they get. First of all, they're gonna get a piece of this 300,000 reward um, pool. That is, there's only 564 ships that went on that mission that could afford the 5,000 TLM. So about 500 TLM each for going on the mission and Kerplam, legendary. Now these cards all do something different. All these things actually have meaning, uh, which will come into the game later. Guys, let me just say, I had completely written this game off, completely. Like all the bots came in, it wasn't any fun. There was problem after problem after problem. And sadly, I completely written it off. I was on my way somewhere else. Luckily for me, 
I kept on the uh, newsletter. So when I got the thing the other day about there being a mobile version that actually worked now, and I went and looked at it skeptically, uh, I was extremely surprised and extremely happy and very happy that I've come back. These missions are going to be fun. So yeah, I think you can take as many spaceships as you want, but you're only going to get uh, five NFTs per mission no matter what. But you'll get like an NFT per spaceship up to five is what I believe the, the total is. When it comes back, it will be over here and it will tell you that you can now claim your stuff. You claim your stuff and, and there you have it. And so guys, something you don't want to miss out on before you you know, get too close to missing out on a mission, make sure you have some BNB in your uh, MetaMask wallet here because I tried, I was running out of time, I got myself a bunch of TLM, I was trying to go on this epic mission and I went to send it where well, you gotta pay gas fees on BNB. It's way better than Ethereum. It's like 55 cents, but I didn't have any BNB. So then I went around and, and I went on Binance and I had to putz around for about 20 minutes try as the, as the clock is ticking and Binance could not get me ver verified. I had to verify my identity. Their little things wouldn't work with the driver's license and all that stuff. So I had to go to KuCoin, I had to cash out some stuff, and then I sent it to my wallet. It just took forever, and I missed out on leaving for the mission. So I'm going to keep an eye out and look for it um, tomorrow to go on the next mission. Horaclick 9. She immediately assimilated the molecule with the DNA of her bodyguard, an explosive specialist. When a discovery mission team entered her laboratory, they found thousands of test tubes growing a terrifying new minion. Our engineers are working around the clock to restore the rest of the transmission. Okay, that transmission is actually ready to go right now and is being posted on all of Alien World's social channels. Good luck, explorers. And receive creepy creature NFTs. Blend the creatures to receive tickets. Can you collect them all in time? <laughs> Hold the tickets for rewards. <laughs> the four lands are Nayron 3318, Nayron 259, <laughs> Magor 3814, Kavion 3910, October 21st to October 31st, it's Wax Gamers Halloween Extravaganza. <laughs> Check waxgamer.com for details. Wow, that's pretty cool. I guess the Halloween thing is going right when I made this video. I didn't know that was actually going to happen like that, but it just kind of proves my point that Alien Worlds is back. It's some really cool stuff going on, guys. Oh, let me hit teleport. So you're going to need to probably teleport some of your TLM to BSC unless you bought it, unless you bought TLM from somewhere, but it's very easy to connect your wallets. What I did, being a wax guy, I had a ton of wax, and I went to Alcor, uh, the Alcor exchange. I'll put the link down there, and I exchanged some of my wax for the TLM to try to get it over there to the mission. Once I got it there, I could connect my wallet, my wax wallet, to my BSC wallet. I'm gonna put, pick choose chain, pick Binance. I've already, I'm already on my MetaMask over here. And then you're just transferring stuff from here to there. You've got to, you've got to uh, claim it. It's very, very simple. But then you've got the uh, TLM in your BSC uh, MetaMask wallet so that when a mission comes up, you can then stake it. Again, make sure you've got a little BSC. I think it's 0 .001, which is like 55 cents. You've got to have that in your MetaMask wallet to, before you transfer the stuff so that you can accept it. That's the gas fee. Have that ready, especially if you want to go on a mission uh, at any moment. And you might want to have some TLM already waiting for you because I, the, as, as I understand it, the missions are random. They're popping up out of nowhere. So, Hey, I gotta go. I gotta go mine, uh, alien worlds and try to find some zombies and try to find some whatever else they're giving away. I appreciate you guys. Thank you for sticking around with me. Thank you for all the stuff like button bell. You guys are awesome. Give me a comment. I appreciate it. Kapapish!